shared just for you. I mean, to score that goal, the play from Jack, what did that feel like knowing that you scored that goal and it's 11 straight wins? I think it's really good for the team because we keep it going and we have 11 games winning streak and Jack played well on the world times. He made it this goal and we need to just put it back to empty net, I think. Back, but first, I think it's no goal because the referee hand is up. I'm just, I don't know. <laughs> how, much, how much fun are you having playing with this group over this stretch right now? Because I think your role has kind of changed a little bit. You're doing a lot of the defensive work too than maybe we saw from last year. Uh, I think it doesn't matter what I'm doing. I just It's all for the team and for our winning uh, games, winning streak, and we're doing well. And what can you say about the way VTech has played here over this, uh, the way VTech has played these last, you know, two, three weeks? VTech. How is v. he playing? Yeah. Yeah, he's playing unreal. Yeah. He's playing unreal. He did it today, big saves. He's helping team to win, and he's a great guy. Where's the uh, the belief level in this team? I like the resilience in the third period. You give up the tying goal, but you still find a way to stick to your game, hang in, and, and get the win in overtime. Uh, I think we just do it all three periods. Our job, we play it like good hockey, quick hockey, and we when we don't have uh, when we don't give it to Tarana space and time, we have chances and tur after turnovers and. We find it like our third goal in overtime. 11 game win streak. What kind of a statement do you think that makes to the rest of the league about your group? So, what is what do you think the rest of the league is seeing from you guys about who you are with 11 straight wins? Uh, I don't know. I think <laughs> we just don't think it about streak. We just think it about all the time. Next game, next game. How we how we need to play, and we just focus on the, every game. Doesn't matter what streak. Eric, 11 in a row. I know we talked this morning about being conscious of, you know, needing to build that but not getting too excitable. I mean, what what does this do for this group, though, as you continue to build on these? Uh, I mean, yeah, it's it's fun. It's so much fun right now, and, and you can see it on the ice. And, and uh, you know, we're fighting, we're battling. It's not always perfect. And I give Toronto a lot of credit. They put us on our heels multiple times, and, and uh, v, v keeps playing great. And, and uh you know, we're making the plays when it counts, and, and that's good. How much does that really tell you about the entire group as a whole, that you're able to hang in there even when you are on your heels and, and really gut certain certain wins out? Yeah, it's just like care for one each other right now. It's, uh, you know, it's we really come together, I feel like, as a team and and, uh, and build something something unique. And, and, uh, and uh, you know, I'm proud of the guys so far, just the way we built and, and just kept with it and just not be satisfied and, right. and just that hunger it's uh, it's impressive and and uh, but like we talked before it's just you know enjoy it right now and then we got another test coming up so um, and we just get back at it is that hunger a learned thing that like you guys have like some guys have to learn how to be hungry um, I think it's a process of uh, getting there. I, I think the hunger is there for everybody when the season starts of, of having a goal uh, as a team, and, and then you, you start building towards it, and then, and then you kind of start proving yourself what kind of team you are, and and, uh, and putting the product on the ice, and that's that's where the confidence comes into play as a, as a group and as a team, and and we've definitely gained that, and and uh, but. You know, those things can be taken away, so we got to make sure we keep at it. What more can you say about V? I mean, you mentioned him quickly there, but the way he went down in that game in Ottawa, but come back in fine form these last two games. Yeah. Um, I mean, there's not much to say. He's He's been unbelievable for us and, and good for him. What do you like most about how the team is playing through this 11-game winning streak? Maybe apart from the wins. Yeah, just finding ways, uh, playing for one each other, like I said, uh, one another. Um, good goaltending, just, you know, if it's special teams, whatever it is, you know, night in, night out, we, we do something uh, that helps us win games and, and it can be big blocks, whatever it is, uh, you know, we, we're playing as a group. When you see that play by Jack and Cher finishing it off, what, what I mean, I see your smile, but what goes through your head knowing where you guys are? Uh, yeah, just uh, pleasure. I mean, it's just fun, fun right now. And, uh, yeah, just poor happiness, I guess. Uh, it was definitely that the whole bench was excited and uh, just riding the wave right now and uh, keep improving, but we're playing well, so we just uh, 
got to fix some little things, trying to get a better team, and but uh, a lot of good things we, we're doing right now. Other than the results itself, where does the, the big part of the belief as a group come in for you guys? Um, I mean, you can see it out there. Like We're playing as a unit. Everybody knows his role, and uh, we're playing simple, uh, straightforward hockey. And uh, if everybody does that and uh, we uh, don't turn up pucks over, especially against teams that have uh, lots, lots of offense, uh, then it's going to be hard to score against each uh, against us. And uh, I think uh, you were able to see that in the third. I, I honestly don't think they had a lot of chances in the third to tie that up. And uh, we got a little unfortunate bounce there. And uh, to have that resilience and uh, come back and with a mindset, oh, now we need another one to win this game. Uh, just great to see. And uh, guys stepping up and doing, doing the job. It's just it's what a good team is. Uh, do. Uh, that, that was sort of what I was going to say. Look, after Nylander scores that goal, you guys are about to head into overtime. What what are you saying to each other in that moment? If exactly anything that. has to be said. My, mindset change. Uh, tie game. Now it's uh, it's all open. Uh, we need another one to win. And uh, I think everybody understood that. And uh, you could see we, we came out OT and uh, uh, had them in their zone right away and uh, had a change there. And then Jack and then Cher went on and uh, buried it. So it's Happy for Cher? 100%, <laughs> yeah. What kind of a statement uh, yeah. do you think this makes an 11-game win streak to the rest of the league? Yeah, we're a good team. Uh, we are a good team. We're a really good team. and uh, We believe in each other here. And uh, we're playing some really good hockey, and it's not going to be easy uh, playing against us. Does this game make a statement, do you think, Nico, like this particular game? Like just in the way that you want it and everything? And with, uh, with a couple other games that uh, yeah, we had some know, good wins. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. No, it's just something. But it's you're just like in the, the center of the universe tonight. Yeah, you know? I, I agree. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, uh, yeah. Lots of eyes on, <laughs> on, uh, on us here. But uh, we just try to focus on our game. Uh, for, for us, it doesn't really matter who we're playing. Uh, we try to, to come out with a consistent game plan we always have and uh, play our devil's hockey game and uh, we've been doing that uh, lately and uh, that's why uh, we have this record. What's your relations on the win 11 street? Uh, you keep learning more and more about your team. Anything in particular you learned tonight? Uh, no, I uh, you know, thought it was a real hard fought game. Uh, gave up a few rush opportunities early in the first but I thought we really started to play well defensively in the last 40 minutes and you know just uh, proved again that you know, in a tight game, 2-1 game, that, uh, you know, we can play the game the right way and uh, we're able to win the tight ones. What does it say about your group? We were just talking to Nico and he said, you know, when Nylander tied it up, there was no panic. It was just, all right, it's a tie game. Let's go get the next one. Well, I, you know, I think you saw the, the, the next couple of shifts. We were right back at it. Uh, you know, I think if there was, you know, kind of a negative in the game would have been some of our execution on, on some of our high-quality chances, our 2 and ones 3 and ones um, you know, I really felt that we had a great, great opportunity to put the game away. I, I thought Murray made an unbelievable save on Jack that, uh, you know, kept the game at 2-1. So, you know, he made, he probably made four or five high quality uh, saves. Uh, but at, at the same time, you know, we just kept playing our game. I'm just happy for uh, Cher, the way he was able to just put in that puck after what Jack did on that play there. <laughs> yeah, you know, heck of a play by Jack. Uh, you know, I don't know exactly what happened around the blue line, but uh, you know, Jack took it to the net, and I saw the uh, the open net for Cher. Well, Coach, uh, just what can you say about your captain's play, Nico? He just keeps going to the next level. Just the, the ownership and knowing when to shoot, take take that part of his game to the next level as well. Oh, he's he's playing just uh, great hockey for us, uh, leading by example. You know, making all the right plays, killing penalties. You know, we had a couple of big kills we had to to, to kill off in the uh, third period. And, I thought Nico's reads on some of those were, were fantastic. And, you know, his effort uh, defending along with uh, what was going on uh, offensively, I, you know, I just thought it was a great night for him. What kind of a statement, Lindy, do you think this 11 game win streak makes to the rest of the league? Um, it, you know, we're t I don't know if we're, we're really focusing on the rest of the league, we're just focusing on the next game. And, um, you know, we put this one behind us and, and move on, knowing that, you know, we're just trying to improve our game in, in different areas. And, you know, I think, you know, you've got to have a lot of good things happen to, to run a streak like this, because in this league, a goalie can beat you. You know, a couple bad bounces can beat you. Uh, 
but we've definitely we've played with a lot of pace and a lot of speed, and uh, we've been able to to take it to a lot of teams. There's been a lot of talk of your defense, you know, being long and, and good skating, big. Do you think Siegenthaler kind of embodies that? Oh well, yeah, you know, I mentioned this morning that that group of six has really played well. Uh, size, reach, and Siegenthaler is a big part of that. Um, doesn't get a lot of credit for the offensive side, but does get involved, gets pucks to the net. So, uh, you know, the group is is really locked in to playing a, a, a re really good style of hockey.